Hey, how are you? This is Gunfo coming to you today. I know I haven't posted a video in a long time. I apologize about that. Been extremely busy. Blah, blah, blah. You know, same on, same off. There was two mass shootings over the weekend. This past weekend. Um, I'm going to try my best to, uh, to not use profanity in this video because the simple fact is family members may be watching this video children may be watching this video not necessarily children directly but people with families may be watching this video so to a direct statement to the um, the cowards that uh, do these mass shootings y'all are cowards I really want to call y'all out y'all name that's real talk y'all are female dogs and I'm not joking everyone that has an AR-15 carried in your vehicle from here on out these mass shootings have to stop, and it's not going to take any gun law. No gun law is going to stop it. Drugs been illegal, and people use drugs all the time. Not to mention all the various weapons that are used in a lot of different altercations and acts of violence. So therefore, no, no gun law is going to help, period. But what gun law I will agree with is a national carry gun law. A CPL, a CCW, whatever state you live in, that is an infringement on your right. An infringement on the Second Amendment. If you're going to play games with one right, then you're going to play games with all of them. We're not about to sit here and play these games. I feel bad for the families out there. I know we're not even supposed to be talking about this to give the predator the energy that he needs. But this video is not, is not going to be seen by too many viewers, nothing too many people, but it's still the point. I have to get this off my chest. People that do commit mass shootings, mass murder, y'all are disgusting animals. And I promise on everything. This AR-15 in this bag I will carry in this vehicle. You will not, not around me. It's not going to happen. Not a Walmart, not anywhere. Anywhere I'm at, no, it's not going to happen. You're going to get put down. This dude killed 22 people. You're getting dropped. I'm not playing no games. This is a direct message to any, any vicious mass killer, murderer, any. This stuff got to stop. Trump, a so-called Republican, no, that's a lie. You're not pro-gun. You're not pro-gun. Pro-gun is all the way 100% guns. If you say anything against guns, talking about a national red flag gun law, that is not pro-gun. We need the only gun law possible, a national carry law. Everybody carry. Everybody. Everybody and their mama, grandma, whoever. Get Do away with the CPL. Do away with the CCW. Everyone need to carry. And it don't need to be, no. 18, year, 18 years of age need to be the limit. Right then and there. Bottom line. At 18 years of age, you should be responsible enough to protect your own family bottom line because you mean to tell me you can't protect yourself if you're 18 somebody come in your household yeah i don't think so i really don't 18 years old a, a pistol not a rifle not a shotgun not a long gun no national carry law pistols shotguns long guns anything you can get your hands on Now that I got that off my chest, I'm going to have some videos coming out. I got a total of probably five guns this year. Very proud of my collection increasing. I had to get that off my chest. Everyone that has an AR-15, carry it in your truck. Carry it in your vehicle. Bottom line. In Michigan, here where I live, I can't have the magazine inside the um, AR-15. I can't have it. So the detachable magazine has to be separate from the gun. It can be in the same bag. It can be, I already went over the laws, called the police station multiple times to figure it out. The same thing with shotguns. However, if you got your pistol and you need to work your way back to your AR-15 and load it, do what you got to do. These cowards are usually wearing three, level 3A body armor. That 556 NATO round, it will go right through that body armor, bottom line. That 9mm that you keep on your hip might not necessarily take out somebody with, you know, that level 3A body armor. So you better go for the T-zone or the uh, pelvis area, bottom line. But, 
22 people dead is absolutely ridiculous. If that was me, <laughs> I don't care what kind of aim you got. Aim at him. I'm not about to act like I'm the best shooter on earth. No, but no, you got Terrence Heck to go in. <laughs> Jerry Mitchell, like, however, drop him. Drop him. Tackle him. Fight him. Everybody. Crowd against him. What, what, is, what happened to people? What happened to the fight in y'all hearts? Wait, wait, let's go now. Take these people out. 22 people is too many people dead. That is ridiculous. Let me be up in that place. Would have dropped that boy right where he stood. Exercise the Second Amendment. And to keep the families in my prayers. Thank you for watching. Have a blessed day.